Um, so, hi. I don't really know what this video is, um, but yesterday I got accepted into AMDA on a full ride scholarship. Let me just tell you this. This YouTube channel, Starry Ache, is a compilation channel, a memory boarding channel, a memory hoarding channel, um, a channel where if you want to watch, it's probably because you know me and you want to make sure I'm not dead. Um, this is nothing. A YouTube account that actually um, does well and has followers because of the niche subject that I am doing is uh, the Michael Jackson one. Yes, I'm fixing. I can't even see. Oh no. Okay. So, listen. AMDA has accepted me for their Bachelor's of Fine Arts in Vocal Performance for Commercial Music degree beginning in the fall 2024 in LA. It's a total institutional scholarship valued at 6400. 64000, which is 1600 per academic year for four years. Um, I've talked to my dad. I've been, I've started to pray a lot, like a lot, because I don't know if this is what he wants me to do. Um, it's insane. Like at three o'clock in two hours, I have a phone call interview with a reporter. And the school's gonna announce my name today, or on Monday, and then I have Skills USA tomorrow. So I need, to, I just took tests and I need to pack, and I, I'm kind of all over the place. Um, and it's like, I don't really know what I'm doing. So if you watch the I'm About to Be a Senior, I didn't know what was happening out of this year. And now I'm a senior, I'm going to be graduating in less than seven weeks. And it's been insane. 4-3-24. Dear Lord, I believe you brought me to LA to experience life. I think it's somewhat crazy that I decided to sing and not record a film as intended. I think it's crazy that I was chosen. I think it's crazy that despite telling someone I didn't want to be there, I was there. Lord, I don't know what your plan is, but I want to have peace with what you've chosen for my life. Give me peace and show me where I'm meant to go. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I want to be fully convinced that whatever answer is given to me in here, that is the answer. Like, I don't want to doubt. I don't want a lick of doubt because moving to LA to go to school for singing as a Christian girl is, is one of the most dangerous things you can do. I thought nothing was coming out of Amda. I thought nothing was coming out of SoCal. I didn't even think I deserved to be there. Um, I sang a song and I did a crappy monologue. <laughs> like, I was sure that that monologue knocked me down a few picks. It's not, it's not me saying, oh, I'm just so good, I'm so humble. No, it's not that. It's just me genuinely thinking. I, I was surrounded by such talented people. There's no way I was even in the same ballpark as them, you know? And I remember specifically when we were in the we were in the dance room, um, the guy kept looking at me and kept kept smiling. I wasn't really talking much, but he kept smiling at me. The person who auditioned me at Trader Joe's and he gave me kind of a nice smile. I was the last person to audition, um, which my brother said was a good thing, I guess. I don't know. I know nothing about auditioning, okay? It's a full ride scholarship. Is it clean cut? No. But it's a full ride scholarship. Do I want to put my entire life here on hold? Do I want to go long distance with my boyfriend? Do I want to go long distance with my family, my friends, my everyone, my church? Because my church is a huge part of my life. Like, do I want to have to go find a new church in LA? Because I know for a fact I will need it. A good one at that. I don't want one that's going to watered down the gospel like I, I need real church you know and I have a real church here do I want to find one by myself in LA do I want to 
start. I can't even say start over because I've never been away from my parents and I've never been away from anyone. But, okay, I don't know. I know at some point you're supposed to live life away from your parents. I'm cutting a tag just so you know. But I know at some point you need to live a life away from your parents. And I've been somewhat guarded from being ha having to do that because COVID took me away, took all of us away from, from kind of developing the way normal people develop, um, like mature level wise. Like I feel like everyone is a year younger than they are. And it's so crazy. Cause I already had two people ask me for advice about how to get this Fulbright scholarship. And I told them, I said, I didn't know they offered this at all. This is news to me. They just said I had a scholarship with my acceptance letter. I have never applied to a college before. Have I said this? I've never applied to a college. I haven't even applied to my community college. I haven't even applied my, I had just done FAFSA that week. I just done my first taxes this week. It just, it just, I turned 18 on February 17th. I turned 18 and life happened. So fast, I didn't get a moment's breath. I, it was like, as soon as I turned 18, it was, hey, by the way, we have to do taxes. Hey, by the way, we have to do this, you know? And what's, what is insane to me is everything pushed me to sing. Like, okay, I don't think I'm gonna be a singer when I grow up, no. I can't even say when I grow up. I'm here, you know? Um, but like, I never wanted that. I, I didn't start singing in front of people till July of last year. It's about to be July. Right now it is March, okay? March, April, May, June, July. In four months, it'll be a year since I started singing in front of people and at my church. I did SoCal. Then my teacher, one of my teachers was like, yo, be in the play, get in. Why didn't you audition? And I said, because swim team. And then my shoulder gets busted. Like I haven't swam all year and it's been breaking my heart watching everyone swim without me. Like it's been awful. I've cried about it. My coaches know. Um, and and um, sorry, I just saw on my page, um, there's, there's a quote up here. It says, it's not because things are good that we are to thank the Lord, but because he is good. And the person who wrote it is named Hannah Whittle Smith. <laughs> so we're gonna ignore that. Um, and, but it's, it's, it's insane that I, I went to the play, all right? I auditioned for the play, got in the play as one of the girls. Um, one, I'm doing Legally Blonde, by the way. I'm the I'm one of the sorority sisters. And then I go to SoCal, I audition, womp womp. I don't have a monologue. Whoa, can't act. Um, so I do a vocal performance. And they were like, you just started singing in July? And I was like, yes, because that's when I started. Um, and I'm not lying, you know, I, I didn't say it to wow them. I just, that's what happened. And it's, I just don't know. I don't know, this is such a big deal, you know? Like it's insane how big of a deal this is. It's not some community college. I am going to be four hours away from everybody that I know and I love, you know? And the closest person I'll live near is an hour away. This is real life. Like, this is real life. Um, but it's, it is um, 12.03, okay? 
it is 12.03 a.m. I need to be up by 5.30. <coughs> so I am going to stop yapping. I'm going to sleep. And I'm going to talk to you guys in the morning, maybe, if I have time. I might not. Who knows? I might talk to you when I get back from skills. I'll never know. Hannah never listens to the past Hannah when it comes to this stuff. So, I love you. God loves you. Peace. Um, I'll be praying on this. I will read my Bible before sleep. Because I need it. So. Hi, guys. Hi. It is the morning of departure. Um, I am eating uh, oatmeal because it's oatmeal and I need to pee really bad. But I'm glad I need to pee because the last trip I went on, I didn't do anything and I got really sick. So yeah, I have my headphones because I'm ready. But I can't wear headphones and a hat at the same time, you see? But I'm okay with that fact because I look cute anyway. So, I don't remember what I wanted to talk about last night, to be honest with you. I have $20 in cash for four days. Um, and then on my card I have some money that I don't want to spend, but I have it. Um, I won't be eating very healthily there, and I won't be eating very much because of that fact of not having very much money. I don't really want to splurge on food. I don't really want to be there. So, you know. Um, I am very thankful because they let me use my editor which I used to make the last video. And then my teacher's laptop totally broke. And so they couldn't use what they needed to use. And thank God I was already using my computer the first time. Because that would have made me go ballistic, I think. If all of a sudden I didn't have a device to do my video on, yeah, that would not be fun. It's a longer car ride than SoCal. I gotta go. Uh, opportunity to gas up but here's the deal if those homeboys are not here by the time <laughs> like we're leaving them yeah if we're they're saying. not here by the time i gas up we are on the road yeah My we're, road we're energy, gone our van is full oh, we gotta put our seatbelts head we gotta put our seatbelts <laughs> <laughs> Back at it again, guys. Literally. The hair is not hearing, and that's okay. It's not always gonna I didn't brush my hair today because I woke up late. I I woke up at 6.30. What time did I wake up? 5.30? I woke up at... I'm gonna say 6. That's when my alarm I woke up and I got... I woke up to like 10 messages from Adrian. <laughs> Yeah, someone was a little late. Okay. Um, so we're heading to Ontario. Skill stuff. Do I want to be here? Not really. The prize is a thousand dollars. A thousand dollars scholarship. Which finding out. I mean, if I was to get it, would I be complaining? No. But I'm not gonna try very hard. Yeah. So. Um. Good check. I'm overdressed. It's not. Yes, but I had to put a rubber band back there. Me. So. Mm. Adi, what are we going to do? Like that? We're going to hide in the back so, there, so that we can get food early. Apparently last year, they didn't get to go. They got scraps or something. They got scraps. And we don't want scraps. We're hungry hippos. Yeah. And, yeah. Yup. Get your ass really. over here right now. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, if you don't go on right now, we are gonna wait, leave wait, wait. you. Are they the only ones that are missing? Because we can drive over there. Uh, yeah, we can drive. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, I think so. Wait. No. Wait. Wait. Can you talk with you guys? Yeah. Okay, they're all <laughs> okay, over there. Okay, they're, they're all, all over there. there. Okay, you sure? Yeah. yeah. Okay, then we can, we can go to you guys. 
I'm gonna need a hair tie. Do you want one of them? I think so. Do you have one? I have one. Have one. <laughs> yes. I'll give it back to you when I get it. Okay. So. Ooh, that's the wrong mic. So, um, we can't get in until three. We can't. So we have to, look at that island of peace. Yo. Wait, is that going to take it like four hours to clean the room? I don't know. Maybe they should just get faster. Um, but. they going to like deep clean everything? We're going to go to the mall. Yes. Oh, look, my phone did a thing. Are they going to have hard drives for me? Like the video oh, and subscribe to my my little because film account. Make Hannah Reese three K. She's at two K right now. That's Another that's my Michael account. Are you following us? So the real people. Oh, he said something. Oh. He scrolled down his window. Who? Said something. Scrolled it back up. I did not understand. Oh, I told him. Where are you, you muppet? Literally, <laughs> yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm letting them know. Oh yeah. Look at him. He's about to start crying already. We just got here. <laughs> we just got here. <laughs> day one. <laughs> day one. <laughs> Me at the end of today. It's yeah. going to happen. Like 20 minutes after we get here. I love bawling. my feud with this man. It starts bawling. It's the greatest. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> you sure Boo! Get <laughs> you need to leave. <laughs> My bad. So you sorry. Too, you too. My bad. We're film people. We're of film. course we're gonna film the same angle at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> It's pretty hot. Huh? I've always wanted to try a Jolly Bee. Wait. Oh, you recorded. Hi. Hi. Yeah. Um, we're at Jolly Bee right now, and we're getting a Jolly Bee. Because we've never had, and, and there's there's chicken there. Wait, let's see what other. Okay, and there's a Marshalls, which is what Jackie wanted to do. There's so much to do. I'm actually gonna buy these. <laughs> like for real? What are the odds I'm gonna ever there. use this again, guys? What? Besides today. Oh, <gasps> Britain! Oh. He's looking for one. Oh, it's fifty dollars and small. Never mind, Britain. You don't get one. Sorry. It's if it was bigger and he could put his computer Here, in it, I get it. You can put like a drone. You can put. I got my crybaby necklace that I wanted since I was twelve. Um. Got Jackie, looking at stuff. Oh, we got. I got a um a sun and moon necklace. I'm gonna give one to Britain, I think, because that's cringe. So of course I'm gonna do it. So, yeah. We got panda. I'm like yeah, me too. And I was like, you've liked it for an hour. <laughs> Dave's hot chicken. Dave's hot chicken. I've heard that, that was. I've heard it was good. We got the reason I went to SoCal. Playing in the car. I should have opted for a real food okay. instead of a watermelon ice cream. Our hard drive was going to put the what finished video. Right. We're, we're literally pulling the the yes. So I was tasked with bringing up more than I could carry. So um, we're living life. You know, we're living, we're living so much life. All right. Wait. I'm holding her blazer. We are in our hotel room. Yes, I'm filming right now. <laughs> okay, this was chaotic. Every, our room was the only room that was open. Nobody else's room was ready. And look at the light. Okay. Does anybody need deodorant, perfume, pads, or band-aids? I have them. She, she got the goods. I haven't even started getting dressed yet because I haven't either. This Piper, she's killing it. She's like ordering everyone around and stuff. It's great. Um, but like in a good way, you know? I'll give a room tour when there's nobody in here. Um, but this door is super heavy, which is nice. We're in the fourth floor. I have a question for you guys. Did anybody bring a raincoat too? I got like shorts and a shirt to sweat. 
I did not bring. Buy one. Just wear something. You don't mind getting wet. I brought shorts. Later. Yeah. I don't even know. I don't have. It's like wet. You're gonna be busy. Oh yeah. So what are you doing? No sleep for us. We're gonna be uh. Wiz. No, we're actually gonna go over with Matt. Are you for real? Really? So what do you do? I'm dead serious. Yeah. What do you do? So like. Okay. It's it's Saturday morning. It's like four or five hours, and they give us like four plans, and they tell us. Mo model this and the software that we use, uh -huh. and like make a few changes. To it. Oh. Like, that's all I have to do. Wait, really? So are you like, are you vibing? Yeah. Or are, you, are you stressed? Because or are you just like, I saw I'm friends good. Like, You're good. I've done and medical, medical, I'm good. And that's fair. With us, we have to we get this oh, random prompt. No, we have to film. Actually, guys, huh? <laughs> <laughs> we have to get this random prompt. <laughs> then we get another <laughs> random prompt. <laughs> then we have to <laughs> film. <laughs> then I have to edit. <laughs> and I get 36 <laughs> hours <laughs> to get a video done. You already get like half an hour. We have one prompt. Um, something about oh, is is education like worth it anymore? Basically, like going into the future, stuff like that. So we're talking about SoCal, actually, with theater and all that. That's all I have. <laughs> but um, we got 36 more hours. Once we get the next prompt, we have to add those prompts together, and it's gonna be a thing. We need a floor plan. We need lighting. We need Three minutes. Not including bars and tone, which is like that, those color bars and like the beep. <laughs> Brightness is crazy. Wow. Okay. Hi, people. Um, it is 4.09. The chaos is subsiding a little. A little. Um, it's probably going to be freezing. I'm going to be so thrilled. Um, and cold. Oh yeah, I turned that down. That's fine. Um, we're showing off the the, the shade. But until 4:40 before we get our prompt and get like stared at by judges. Pick your hair in a bun. <gasps> I don't have a, I don't oh, have a purse. Okay. I think we can bring a purse, by the I'll way. I don't even get my hair braided. At the thing, we can't. That's what they said. We could bring a purse? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm going to bring a little black one. <laughs> I mean, it's going to have to. Abby! Oh, look, I'm going to break the pants on Oh, my. <laughs> um... But yeah. Do you guys so, think they're gonna get mad by the lines on my podcast? No, I think they're gonna Cause no, because this is the first time we're doing video news production with new judges. Oh, well, so we don't know how. Not let's hope they're not. Yeah, jerk. Which is not okay. Is my first, my first skills in the same experience is going horribly. It's kind of unexpected, not horribly. <laughs> uh, that might think I left my makeup bag in there. Shit, my hair looks better. Um, it looks better, yeah. Okay. It just needed a lot of water. This oh, is really dead. Oh. I stopped taking care of it this year. <laughs> Um, so already we've started using each other's stuff, because we needed to. Our curly hair girls got to save the other curly hair girl. Um, I'm bald-headed, uh, but this I'm bald-headed, bro. Can we bald it up? Um, we've been playing music and chilling. It's 4.30, oh, we need shit. to be downstairs by 5. Um, well, I'm going to play music. Okay. We still have four until... Did you disconnect I disconnected. She told me to. I Um, I brought a tiny blanket and a tiny cap, because... I might need that. Oh, that's my pillow. Nothing I hate about these shoes, they're kind of big on me. Yeah. These two, bro. Uh-uh. How do you walk in my head? No. Okay. How do I feel? I feel good. I feel I'm I feel nervous. I feel a bit nervous. Really it's okay. We'll, we'll survive. This one? No, this one's fine. Oh, this one's fine. They're both fine. Get in. How are you feeling? Dying. Good. Crying. <laughs> Why is everything happening? I know. Okay. <laughs> I think it goes on the red. <laughs> ah! Um, so listen. I'm gonna fight skills you as I am. They changed everything. Basically. They said it didn't change much. They changed everything. Yes. We're really mad. I, I think I'm good. I got 20 bucks on me. What happened? What did you do? Audie? 
How are you feeling? I'm feeling good, chat. Okay, chat, look. Let me let you know. This this inter this judge guy. Yeah. He's got he, he needs to leave. He needs to, he needs to leave. His attitude is Okay, let the ops know. His attitude is <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, listen, Kirby literally said before we went there, if you guys don't think this is fun, we don't have to do it next year. I mean, I'm graduating. Still. I. No. Equipment for tomorrow, what do you guys want? Do we have mics? Mics? We should be. Kirby said meet, meet in the lobby at, in 15 minutes. Okay. Piper needs to be here. Okay. Okay. Here's what's happening. Um. Where is the trash in this place? Right here. Awesome. So, what if she's going to have to remember to take it out in the morning? We went to the thing, and we got the prompt. Okay, bye everyone. Bye, Audie. Bye. Please, be... And we got the prompt. Please get rest. Are you my price? I will not be sleeping, sorry. <laughs> I know you won't. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Get the prompt, and then... All these God, stuff, God. All this stuff changes, <laughs> and they're like, oh yeah, by the way, you have to go in with us for four hours. We don't like this rule, but that's what happened. We're like... Huh? What? Okay. And so now we have basically 29 hours and counting because guess what time it is? It's 10:23. I'm not sleeping tonight because we need schematics. We need scripts. We need the. I know I'm yapping like a little. What time is the time check, y'all? 1:19 in the morning. And then you got them two back there. They're doing a thing. Uh oh. Say hey guys to the vlog. <laughs> oh, it's 120. My voice is gone at this point. Um, and you want to know how far I've gotten? I've done bars and tone. I was, I did bars and tone. Uh, and I'm doing the intro, which I can't even finish because I don't have all the B-roll. It's really hard to um, do an intro of, like, I don't want to repeat the intro I did. Like, okay, guys, I'm going to put the old intro I did. Good morning. And then whatever is the finished product, uh, is the finished product here that is. In today's edition, we spoke with students who won an industry field trip to, and asked if it was beneficial for their education or not. We also spoke with counselors and teachers to see how they are preparing their students for a workforce. All this and more on Skills USA News. I'm Joshua Sloan. <laughs> Um, <laughs> and so I just didn't want it to be the same. I don't want it to be the same. So I'm changing it a little bit. There's still some that's similar. What? Oh. I've almost broken down twice. And I've fought sleep. There's no way this is happening to me. Oh, I see. Oh, oh. <laughs> You're right by the wall. Sorry. I haven't even moved the text at all. Awesome. Keyframes are hard. <laughs>
time is it? 7.36. Um, pretty awful. Uh, we're all tired. And I didn't tired. sleep. I slept for an hour. And then uh, I haven't had very much water and I need to get something like that. I know. Yeah. Okay, the warm is what we're gonna use. And this is at 11%. Um, got past the interviews, did it, it's fine, cool, she's cool, I like her, it's freezing, literally so cold. Here's dad, went to go get me lemonade and Sprite, because I wanted that, and they didn't have the lemonade in the fountain drink, so he got me actual lemonade, and it was expired, so I wasted a whole extra large fountain drink, because it was expired. What the hell? How do you expire a whole fountain drink? <laughs> Destiny and everyone. Uh, I know Destiny and um, John. They came around and then they left. I don't know where they went. Bro, that was some good stuff though. Which way did you guys walk? The long way. Oh, yeah. yeah. I tried to tell them they could just come to the bathroom. I know that we're gonna go back over there to go to Five Below. I have my man, my man. My man. Suitable. That's a super cool I one. know. My man, my man, my man. I just reacted to this one, and the video did well. So, I'm just saying. Um, key card. So, it is, what is it? Let me check the time. Hold on. It is Friday, 8.04. We have, um, not that long. We have until, we have 12 hours to finish this, um, video. And I'm almost done, but then I started, I volunteered to act in Audie's film. This is what I'm looking at. <laughs> so I still want this little film thing. Um, I'm just getting time to think because it's been kind of crazy. Everyone out, everyone went to get food. Um, not everybody, not everybody, but um, some people need to stay and film like Adrian, things like that. That is a plan. We're right by an airport, and so it's pretty. It's, this has been an experience, and I can't wait to talk about it when I get home, for sure. So, enough, <coughs> I kinda of wanna see what this window is, but I was about to be like, enough lollygagging. Um, but I, I wanna lollygag right here just to see. That is a horrible parking job look. There, I'm still, so we got it. And I used my mom's like I've been discount. To go to GameStop. The GameStop the okay, y'all. So these things look rancid, but they were on the station. Huh? No, I got these at the gas station before we got here. I can just connect in that bag and find so if they're rancid. <laughs> these things are thick. All I know is that we saw the dough, we're like, what? Oh, I want to try it. I forgot I had that shit. I'm oh, sorry. Oh, yeah, what the heck is sourdough? Sourdough? No, 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 not the bread. It's, not so oh. it's a candy. Oh, you you know when they yeah. have a fiber loaf? <laughs> you know. Do you guys know they have these, like, uh, from Sam and Cat. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys know those 
greens, they have at Santa Cat that the got blue banned. Ones? The blue ones, they have them there at Five Below. Do you? They had them. These are I'm weird. I'm freaking out, bro. I'm like sick from the run down. Okay. I run down. You want to do that? Uh, you want to jump down? You literally on jump. I'm not going to get off of this. Uh, oh. like so it's like Laffy Taffy, but... I don't know what it is. I just got it. Yes, uh, I can do that. Uh, it was 50% discount, so... How old is it? 50% <laughs> discount of having a little, so... That's crazy. We're going to find out. <laughs> There's something <laughs> You know, I can... It's the, the texture. texture. It's the texture. It's, the texture. it's like a, it's like fluffy. That's what Nico said. Nico's airheads, but like it's really they're tweaking on me. It's really cornstarchy. Uh, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's in the drive, right? The video. Oh yeah, my god. Let's get in the drive right now. Oh, I have my. Oh, I got green apple, man. Wait, is okay. it really that bad? Can I get uh, a little piece? You can stay in here. Oh my god, I'm tweaking. Can I go to your room? I want to go to my room because I'm probably gonna crash immediately after this. Okay. Uh, give me some paper. Pepper's in there. It's really cool. Take the bag. This is why I don't trust five below candy. Like, what is that? It's um. Hey, you want this banana? I, I, okay. No. <laughs> it's sandy. When I'm done, you see that? Uh, when I'm done, we can do it. Okay. Hi. So tomorrow is when we turn in our projects. We turn on our projects. Um, I'm going to insert our video right now because it's done and it's, it's done. Um, and so, hope you enjoy. In today's edition, we spoke with students who won an industry field trip and asked if it was beneficial for their education or not. We also spoke with counselors and teachers to see how they are preparing their students for a workforce. All this and more on Skills USA News. I'm Joshua Sam. I'm Jose Martinez. And, and you're watching Skills USA, USA News. News. One big question on students' minds is whether or not their educational experience is beneficial. Many people believe that their educational experience did not adequately prepare them for life after high school. But thanks to programs such as CTE classes and other extracurricular activities such as Skills USA and FFA, students are able to find more options and better training in whatever field they choose. We spoke with students, teachers, counselors who were able to give us some insight on the benefits of these pathways and extracurricular activities outside of the class. I am here with Mr. Rodriguez. Hi, I'm Ms. Ferroni. We are here with one of the students who attended the industry field trip, Reese Marshall. Well, it definitely helped me realize the different career pathways that I could take um, within the arts. Um, and it also gave me the hope to actually try and make that my career. Um, and I think that's really important, especially with the arts being as competitive as it is. I think ultimately my subject helps students uh, with their critical thinking skills. And um, that I think is absolutely essential when they get out in the real world. You have to be able to think on your feet, think very quickly and think very critically, not just assume that what you're being given is the truth. You've got to dig, you've got to read, you've got to research and everything that we do I think helps them with that. I think most importantly I want students to understand that time management, organization and deadlines are really important when they go into the real world. According to NASA, this year's ice maximum is the 14th lowest on record this continues the Antarctic ice sheet's rapid decline. In the last several years, the Antarctic ice sheet has begun melting at a drastic rate, causing rising sea levels and accelerating the risk of flooding and erosion. Boeing is under increased scrutiny following a series of emergency landings. These landings have been characterized by technical failures, the most notable of which includes a door falling off the plane mid-flight. More recently, the FAA has given Boeing 90 days create a safety implementation plan following its failure in 33 out of the 89 audits that are conducted. The top four most popular movies in Los Angeles County theaters are Roadhouse, Dune Part 2, Godzilla vs. Kong The New Empire, and Ghostbusters Frozen Empire. Due to the release of Roadhouse, the original 1989 movie is now back in theaters. Love is in the air this NFL offseason, but not for all. 49ers star linebacker Fred and Sidney Warner recently announced the birth of their son, Bo Anthony Warner. Star wide receiver Odell Beckham Jr. and Kim Kardashian have called it quits after six months of dating. 
Lastly, 49ers star quarterback Brock Purdy and Jenna Brandon are now married. Jenna now joins the Purdy family. This has been Skills USA News. Thank you for watching. And stay, stay hungry. hungry. You saw the video. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, we have to turn that in tomorrow at 8 in the morning. And then... I don't know what we're doing. I think I'm gonna sleep. That's all I can think about is sleep right now. Look at look at these designer bags. Um, I finally took my contacts out. I've had my contacts in for three days, so we're finally treating myself like a normal human again. Okay. Good night. God bless. Hi. It is soon Saturday. Everyone's getting sleep. I already know it. How do you feel? Um, Saturday, we're about to turn in our stuff. Really? Oh, I want to sleep. I could barely put my contacts on. I put them in and I felt like they, I had chili oil in my eyeballs. Um, I put on eyeshadow this time. Elevated. It's good. The better one says stop. I'm going to take it. It says stop. Jose, just take it down. Purse, which is where I put it so I wouldn't forget it. Nasty coffee. Um, nasty coffee. And then we have, we have, we have cereal. Last day technically of skills. Tomorrow is when we go home. I wanna go home now! And then, I don't know what time it is. What time is it? I don't know. We're trying to get our scripts right now. Keep the undercut. Oh yeah. Our script is not printing. It's very fun for us. Um, so, Kirby left. We're gonna go with this box. Um, this is an experience for sure. Like, no rest. No. My coffee is really gross, but it's coffee. Um, they're thinking about going to the pool and the mall after this. No, I'm going to sleep. Um, or maybe I'll change my mind. I don't know. I don't have a mini suit, and I don't really want to go buy one. Um, We turned things in. That's what we did. And now we're eating at this place I've never heard of. So this is an emergency exit oh, only. <laughs> we see. What's really funny is that everyone watched us do that. What I like about walking with Kirby is we have to turn around most of the time. Hey. <laughs> in in one way or another, I'm just saying. It's happened every time I'm around you. <laughs> do you get to the destination? We do. And we get there quite early comparatively speaking. Yeah. Yeah, it and we have a story. We the direction. Yes. We didn't come off last <laughs> Literally. <laughs> um, I want you to know, I just want to remind everybody, we you arrived to Ontario first. We did, that's what I'm saying. First. Okay, but first or nothing. Wait for <laughs> we did, but we went to the mall. The we Destiny? Showed, we showed up. Who arrived to Ontario first? <laughs> but we showed up <laughs> comfortably. Us. So yeah. Our van arrived. They told me how you guys had to stop every five seconds to go pee. No, that wasn't that us. That was not us. That was, um... We stopped once and I only let them this is one yep. minute. They kept saying, you want to wait? And we were like, yeah, let's wait. Let's keep going. We're in the moment we were in. We pee when we make it. But yeah, we're, we're at this place called uh, Norms. I don't know what it is, but I'm sure it's going to be great. Looks cool. Look Looks cool. That. It reminds me of, um... Another orange restaurant of sorts. Though I've never. We're not talking about chicken anymore. <laughs> you guys are all canceled. So, yeah, we're gonna eat. Woo. Currently, we are speed walking because we're trying to beat crowds because we need a, we need a swimsuit to get in water. Who did I just see in the background? Okay, never mind. Thought it was somebody who was gonna have to relive some 
problematic times in my life. Um, but it wasn't because that doesn't make sense, Hannah. Um, does it? Cut that out. <laughs> Don't cut it out. Um, so yeah, finding finding at least something that we might have to trash bag it. But honestly, at this point, yeah, big mall can't find store. Wee. This is a caramel bubble orange ice cream. It hits. It's expensive, but it hits. Um, hopefully, YouTube does well too. <gasps> Chlorine helps my skin somewhat, and I don't know how to explain it. I blame the fact that I've been swimming since I was so little that it literally changed my chemistry. But like, if I have bad acne, I swim, and then it gets better. Maybe I am a mermaid. Hi y'all, um, we have chicken, chicken's fire, Popeye's, good, <laughs> um, and I have strawberry fanta, it's good, I'm bald headed right now, bald headed. Woke up about like 15 minutes before we had to leave, mmm, wonderful, good stuff, um, which one? tired, I'm not actually wearing this hat, I just don't have any room. started shaking like that and I legitimately could not type. And like look, that's a thing. That's a thing. Um so when they say video news production, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna So I'm gonna pause this so I don't have to deal with buffering. Because this phone is awful. Oh my god. My head hurts. That's not us. We're doing television videos and we, we like, we had an aneurysm. How do you feel? Are you nervous? Good lord. Woo! To swing. I'm gonna use to dry my dishes and my tears. Because if I don't win, I'll cry. If I do win, I will sob. In, a, in horrible ways. It may slow up. Yes. Someone just uh one named Emily Martinez. I go to church with someone named Emily Martinez, but she's 30. Y'all. Ah! Dang it! Dang it! I didn't want to be up there. You but my initials are up there, so there's something. <laughs> We're currently so over it. Everywhere. Everywhere. And like, it's. A lot of people aren't here um, anymore. But like, audio radio. Where is it? Audio radio. Right. My dad worked for free. I just want. If Audio Radio gets something, I'm good. I'm going. Because, like, we didn't get anything. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Friends are going to be Please. Yes! Yeah! Come on. Please. Okay. Yo! Culinary Arts College. Dang it. Wrong. 
so worth it. Okay, so I, the moment, I, I stopped recording for a little bit, and then audio radio got third. Yeah, audio radio got third. Audio radio got third. Dude, so uh, it's worth it. My hands, they're literally, hold on. <laughs> and we, we got up, and we screamed. And Kirby, screamed. she's all the way over there. Okay, and then we got compliments. They were like, you guys love your team. I'm like, yeah. Um, so Jad, Jad, you ate. Um, um, they're, they're about to go up, and I'm about to film them. Because what? Um, what else? Oh, my jacket. <laughs> oh, yeah! Yeah! Oh, crap! Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah! Oh, shit! <laughs> Oh god! I am not a quiet person. So sorry. We have been sitting here screaming. Okay. So we. My thing is, I came in place gold and silver. I say he's going to nationals, right? He went He got gold. Wow. That's pretty. So, so turn of events a little bit. I, um, I, I rebuke what I said. Um, I rebuke. Um, my head hurts really bad, but I'm not hungry anymore. Our next category is early childhood education, high school. Our bronze winner is Susan Thomas, Pasadena High School. What were we talking about? What were we talking about? What was I saying? Oh, I had to give him my jacket because he didn't have my jacket. I had to give him my jacket because he didn't have my jacket. So he's gonna wear it. I gotta find him. I'm so hyped. Jose, what are you feeling right now? Uh, I'm, I'm going insane. <laughs> we got someone going to nationals. Yeah. Which is insane. It's Isaiah. Wait. Alex does that mean Luke. we have to stay longer? We have to say, do I thought our man was Golden Valley got gold. A Golden Valley student is going to nationals and it's Isaiah. Caitlin got silver. Which is, which is look, insane. Look, we, right now we only got like three medalists. But that's something. But that's, we're so proud of those three. We didn't completely mess up. And oh, and my dad. My dad helps with the audio radio. We did super cool. So technically, I still won. <laughs> Your dad should be very happy. Yeah. Your dad came in clutch. This is the first time they've ever done it. Like, this is the first time Kirby's ever done audio radio. Yeah. TV, TV. No. This is the first year ever we've done this. And we got bronze. Uh, yes, Caitlin. Yes. Yes. Humble queen. Humble queen. Humble queen. Love. Goodness gracious, look at she's so cute! <laughs> oh, Kirby's right there! Look at her! Her thumb! Oh, Kirby! Yeah! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I don't want to graduate! I don't want to graduate! I'll die! I'll die if I graduate! That's so great! I'm so proud! Oh my god! Oh! Oh my god! Me. Yeah, there he is. There you guys are! Yeah. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> They're lost! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Guys. 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 How do you read you? I gotta tell my dad. I gotta tell my dad. And my dad. My dad. First year we've done this, and we got third. Woo! Oh my God, where are our boys? Wait, I don't know. We're trying to get her. Trying to get. Her. Oh wait, okay. Luke says they're having us do something first. They have to be in the middle.
this. Oh. <laughs> um. Again, um, but in the daytime this time. So it's cool and not for reason. What a dog. What a baby dog. <laughs> so let me show you the view. Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> um, it is Sunday. We are headed back and we decided to do a detour because we're insane um, and we're willing to go home later because we wanted to see that again. And um, I'm willing. I'm so okay with it. Um, doing a lot of praying, doing a lot of journaling because I need to know if I want to live here for four years. Um, which is insane to think about. Um, I kind of I kind of drifted off and walked away a little bit from everybody just to see, get that feeling. I know it's a touristy spot, but to get that feeling of walking alone in LA, yeah. Okay. Um, and I'm looking at where Amda is. Um, I can't see Amda, but I can see the uh, the area of which Amda is. Um, and it's putting things into perspective. I'm vlogging currently. We're not vlogging. Um, this is Adrian. Hi. Um, I'm just kind of talking about the whole Amda thing. Uh -huh. Seeing, uh, I was like, I wanted to kind of space off. I know it's a touristy area, but um, walk around alone to really look at LA. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to be here alone for four years. <laughs> That's <laughs> Which is terrifying. Mm-hmm. It is. It is, but it's so pretty and I feel so much more natural the second time. I have more praying to do because I'm not done. Praying. Never stop, really, never stop praying. Never stop praying. Hello, baby. Hello, beautiful. How are you? Um, so it is Sunday, I'm back from Skills USA, and I'm not crying because I had a bad time, it's quite the opposite, um, I have never felt like I mattered I never felt like I mattered more than when I am around Kirby and that whole team and the whole class and I joined that class three months ago okay oh my god I need to talk Boom. I love you cat okay so <coughs> like I didn't want to go to skills literally just earlier the clip you saw before this um, not before this but before the whole video you saw that I did not want to be there and I did not want to 
experience this stress because that's all I knew it was going to be was stress and I wasn't really friends with anyone I thought and like I knew I'd make the best out of it but I didn't think it was going to be so good so I came to the I went uh, sorry I went to Ontario with a little bit of money for food and stuff and I I stayed up all night on Friday, um, all night on Friday, Thursday, sorry. I stayed up all night on, on Thursday, and then Friday night, I um, stayed up a little longer, but I didn't stay up all night, I went to sleep, because they made me go to sleep. And to have my friend Audie want to go to the mall with me so bad that he bought a swimsuit for me because I, he wanted to go swimming with me and he bought a swimsuit for me and I know it's small and I know I know it's small and people bought me food when I, I, I didn't have food or money for food at least um people bought me food and um it was, it was nothing to them, you know, it was like, a, of course, you know. It was... And I know it's really small, I know it's really small. It's so important to me because being at Bear Creek, my old high school, I, no one talked to me and nobody, like, appreciated who I was, really. And the people I met there, yeah, they're nice, but they would never have done something like that. And I, I, I never got out of my comfort zone there. I would have never done this. I would have never gone over and done this if I hadn't moved here. And it's so bittersweet. Because on one hand, it's like, this is the sweetest thing ever, and then on the other hand, it's like, I don't deserve any of these people. My teacher bought me pizza the way back here, and she talked to me, and we talked. My battery died, so I have to change to this until it charges a little bit, but, um, like, my, my teacher, Miss Kirby, bought me pizza because I didn't have money for pizza, um, or for food. I said I'd nap through it all. I would have been fine. You know, we have food at home type stuff. Yeah, we were three hours away, but who cares, you know, that's how I was taking it. Um, we sat and we talked for a good 20 minutes, and she just, she was so sincere, and she just looks at me and she's like, you know, I'm proud of you. And you have no idea how much I need to hear that sometimes, because this year has been insane socially. Been insane socially and it's been insane regarding my faith and it's been insane regarding my work and it's all been so serious and like everything is so serious right now and everything like needs to be done you know everything needs to have you know get done I need to fill things out and like just to stop after the competition after everything just to sit with your teacher that you didn't even think liked you last year and her to say you know I'm proud of you and I your character you've grown so much you know work wise and your character's really shown through and you know I really care about you it's just like no teacher does that no teacher cares that much bro and like She's, she is the best teacher I have ever met. And I'm fiddling with the zipper because I'm like going through it. But like, she kept seeing potential in me and kept moving me up to these classes, you know? I just got here. It's like, oh yeah, you can go to theater two. Yeah, you can go to theater three. Yeah, you can go to GBTV, even though you've never taken a film class in your life, in your, li in, in your school history transcripts or whatever. She's like, yeah, whatever. You know, I want you there. And 
to have all the students during the competition they told me they were like Hannah go to sleep and I was editing and they are like Hannah you need to eat, Hannah you need to do this because I wasn't taking care of myself because I was working to have people that I barely know say that to me when people that I've known my entire life don't even say things like that to me you know care and want me to succeed in life you know succeed in this competition you know it, it's absolutely astonishing and it's so bittersweet because I don't want to leave I don't want to leave high school and that's so pitiful it's, I under, okay I understand you know like but I, I can't you would imagine I can't imagine leaving this school I don't I, and I don't know, I don't know why I'm, I'm exactly feeling this. I think I'm a little exhausted. I think I'm a little exhausted and, and so my emotions are really high right now. But, um, it's, it's like, insane. Because thinking about graduation, it should be a really happy thing. Be a really happy thing. And I, it's gonna be the worst because, well it's not gonna be the worst. It's not gonna be a bad ceremony or anything. It's just like what it means. I can't go to that school anymore and I can't. I can't see the one teacher, the one teacher that like, has literally, the one teacher that has made sure I ate, it was okay, the one who celebrated and posted that I got into a scholarship, that I got a scholarship, and is constantly helping me and saying, you know, we should try to find more scholarships for you. But I know with your worth, work ethic, you can work off, you know, the debts, even if there is some. And it's like... Nobody does that! Nobody does that! You know? I've had two teachers in my life. I've had Mr. Johnson, I've had Ms. Kirby that has ever, ever made me feel like this. Oh, I'm running out of time. Okay, so now that I've got my cool i have 35 minutes and i, I could talk for 35 more minutes um <clears throat> so i don't really remember what i was at um as i was waiting for my stuff to go back to normal i have caught my i've gotten my cool hi baby i missed my boy so much i missed my cat so much um so oh wait i don't want this off i just want it to be chiller so, my teacher gave me a cookie. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm gonna go through these bags just to show you guys like exactly what I'm talking about. When I'm talking about, they didn't have to, but they did. They paid for, some people paid for my dinner. Some people paid for, you know, like I said, a swimsuit. Some people paid for snacks. Everyone got stuff. And their excuse in saying it was okay to pay for my stuff was nothing. They didn't, they said it's fine, you know. Everything in me wanted to figure out what I could do for them, you know. Um, I got this necklace though. It's a Melanie Martinez when I used to really like Melanie Martinez. Not, a fan, not as much as a fan anymore, but I like a fa I'm a fan of that album. I'm ranching. Um, so for example, I'm going to drink the heck out of that. Um, for example, this is a cup full of snacks for the car ride. These have M&Ms in there. <laughs> um, those are snacks. Those are, that's food that I had that I wouldn't have had without them. <laughs> I had two Twinkies, I gave one to a friend because they were hungry, um, <clears throat> and I had, I got two Twinkies. Um, this is from the actual Skills USA spot. They gave this to us to like fling around. I didn't fling it around because at the time I was mad at them, but it's a towel. I don't know what to tell you. They literally gave me a Snickers. I didn't even get to eat everything. There was so much stuff. And like, 
Yeah, so, and then Kirby gave me this, which is <laughs> great. She, she had, she had leftover stuff, so she was like, you can take this, and I said, okay. Um, and I just, all in all, what I'm trying to get at is these people have shown me more kindness and, and I've seen more potential in me in two years, in a year and a half, a year, almost two years, than Bear Creek and Stockton ever did in me, more than most family as well. This whole, I can't even say it, this town has completely changed my life, completely changed my life. I have, I sing at church now, I'm closer to God, I'm closer to people, you know, I've been decently healthy mentally for the past week, and that's a big thing, that is a huge thing, and like, the urge is to like, you know, go, you know, do horrible things. Um, to myself is, is very low right now and it's insane. Um, I forgot to tell you, a uh, little haul. I got a necklace, another necklace. Um, oh! And I had a headache. I had a headache and I had brought ibuprofen. But I gave a lot of people ibuprofen because their heads were hurting and they didn't have anything. So I gave them ibuprofen because at the time I didn't have a headache. And then I got a headache around Saturday and someone gave me their Advil. And it was prepackaged, you know. I was safe about it. Um, but I, someone gave me their Advil, and it's just like little things like that to me, obviously. Then I got um, this, which oops, okay. So one, one is one I had beforehand, but I got this necklace for Britain, my boyfriend. You did not know some people maybe they watch me and they don't know who I am but I doubt this is a moon one and then for me I have the um, Sun one because lately I've been wearing more gold I mean of course the moon is me so I'm thinking he'll be down to um, trade every so often I think so yeah um, Overall, God has blessed me with these people. I genuinely think that. I genuinely think he put these people in my life to give me confidence, to be able to sing for him, you know. Um, I've done a lot of praying. I've done so much praying, you know, in, in the past couple of days because I genuinely believe in none of this. Whoa. None of this was possible without God, you know. Um none of it because we moved here out on a crazy um crazy crazy story of events that required god that had god in it you know that that you couldn't look at that story and go that's not god no that's it's a hundred percent this is a god thing and i'm so glad i'm so I mean, I cried when I thought I was, when, we, when I first found out I was moving, I cried so, so hard because I didn't know, I didn't know what that meant. I was moving in the middle of high school, in the middle of high school, in the middle of, of my high school career. You know, I had built things up, or so I thought I built things up, uh, but getting here has changed my life. I may go to college. I was not going to go to college because, because I go. Because COVID ruined, ruined my drive to go to college at all. At all. And, and I was not getting, I was not going to go there. I was not going to go to college. And, and I wasn't going to go to college here either. Really. I was going to go to middle college, or I was going to go to del um, community. I was going to go to community because it was two years free here. And, oh, um, so that was the plan. That was the plan. God doesn't listen to plans, you know? He doesn't listen to plans, ever. It's his plan, it's not ours. It's never ours, and I knew that. And I still had a plan, I didn't think I had a plan. You know, like, he takes you, and he's gonna use you, and he's going to, he's gonna 
bring you out of that comfort zone, you know? He's going to make you try things, and you're not going to know why you did it. And everyone's going to get mad at you because you're stretching yourself too thin. That's exactly what happened. Everyone sh was like, you're stretching yourself too thin, you're going to go crazy. And I, here I am. Here I am. I'm fine. I mean, I'm crying, but it's a different kind of cry. Um, here I am, alive. Here I am, not stressed. Here I am, with opportunities I did not have two months ago. Because I stretched myself too thin. Because I tried new things. Because something told me I should. When I moved here, my first thought process was nobody knows me, so I'm going to do everything. Because nobody knows me and I can't embarrass myself if nobody knows me. Now a whole bunch of people know me. Now I have a YouTube channel and that is semi-successful. And now I have a, <laughs> now I have a scholarship. <sighs> And I have a church that I like and a church that I love and I'm not used to that. I am not used to that. I was straying so far away from God in Stockton because I just, the people, people were bad. I didn't like people. And it was ruining Christianity and that's what a lot of people are dealing with now. Is people have, 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 have left because people are bad. And that's exactly what happened, but I moved here, and I've never been happier. I have absolutely never been happier, and... Oh my gosh, it's it's maddening. It's maddening. If I told sophomore year me this, she, she'd laugh in your face. She'd laugh in your face. She wouldn't believe you, and she'd say, you're crazy. And she said, nobody wants to watch my video. That's exactly what she said. Nobody would want to watch my video, and nobody likes me. I'm going to go sit in a corner now. God works in ways that are completely unexpected. And God listens to your wants, but he has a plan. And the plan will fit your needs. And maybe not your wants all the time, but he will fit your needs. And I needed people. I needed people because quarantine destroyed me and I needed people and I got people so I got my people and I want you to see my people so this is a compilation oh <laughs> I got my people and I want you to see my people so you're gonna get a compilation of my people and this is me saying bye thank you for watching my skills USA video um sorry that it ended like super savvy and super like this way um i love you god loves you peace Radio Gunther! Radio Gunther, dude!